We got some really great questions around. Um, so we did demonstrations yesterday of our fault test capabilities. So we've been working on that with the Navy for several years. So they're moving to medium voltage DC electric ships. And obviously a series fault, for instance, in that environment could be highly detrimental. So we're trying to uh, develop methods, detect it very quickly, locate it and mitigate it within seconds um, so that it doesn't propagate and damage other assets. And so that's a reality even in the industrial space. So as we start integrating more and more DC power, um, that things like solar panels and wind turbines that create power in a DC space, you have the greater and greater uh, probability that DC might create a series fault and might damage other assets in the system. So we had great just kind of back and forth in that domain. Um, the motor stuff that we've done for years was also of high interest because there, a lot of these groups, I guess, are sourcing motors out of other countries and they're not holding up as long. So a lot of great questions around what might cause a motor to break down, say in five years, and, and what are some of the ways in which motor design has changed over the years that might cause them to not hold up as well in their in their particular environment. So again, another great chance to just kind of use the knowledge base that we have within the center to answer day-to-day -day questions that these guys are dealing with.